New tonight, Ohio health leaders are preparing for this year's mosquito season and the possible spread of the Zika virus. Natalie Tindall with 2 News Investigates was in Columbus for you today and explains what the health officials' biggest concerns are. The point of this meeting was to run through what-if scenarios to make sure all state health leaders are on the same page if the Zika virus starts to be transmitted locally through mosquitoes. It's an urgent topic because there's a growing link between Zika and birth defects. The Zika virus is spreading across the Western Hemisphere in places like Brazil, Central America, and the Caribbean. There have been a few travelers from Ohio who have gotten the virus in other countries, but there have been no reports of disease transmission in the state. But state health leaders are preparing for that at this meeting. The Zika virus doesn't have much of an impact on most people who get it, but the reason health officials are so concerned is the risk it could pose to a pregnant woman's baby. We really do recommend that if there are women that are pregnant where there's areas of ongoing Zika virus transmission, that they consider postponing travel if possible. The reason? Zika could be causing birth defects. For the evidence is very strong to show that there's an association. And for that reason, even though we don't have a direct causal link, we want to make sure people are aware and can protect themselves. The good news for Ohioans is that our state doesn't have the type of mosquito that is carrying Zika in other countries. The bad news? We do have a cousin to that mosquito that potentially could. We are preparing as if it would be as efficient of a transmitter. Um, right now, we don't know how efficient it would be in laboratory settings. It appears that it can spread the virus. The Asian tiger mosquito is what they're keeping an eye on. It's small and can be found during the day in most of Ohio. But the Asian tiger mosquito is very distinct. Uh, it's a jet black mosquito with very bold white stripes on it, including one that kind of goes right down the middle of its back. State health leaders say based off other diseases transmitted by mosquitoes, they hope the Asian tiger won't be a transmitter. The worst case scenario, I believe, with Zika is that we might have some local transmission. I don't think you would see a large scale outbreak because this we don't actually have the mosquito that is responsible uh, for all of the transmission. Now, besides wearing bug spray, these health and mosquito experts are asking everyone in Ohio to try to keep standing water off of their property after it rains over the next several months. This will keep mosquitoes from laying eggs. They specifically ask you to look at bird baths, grill and pool covers, and outdoor playhouses. Natalie Tendel, 2 News, investigates.